Hey guys, this is Jason. I'm coming to you live for some more of this awesome hydrogen concentration water generator technology. And we are using the best on the market for testing for the concentration of hydrogen water with this reagent here. It's called H2 Blue. It's a hydrogen test reagent and in the last video I read the the instructions for use so that got, that way you guys would know that we're properly demonstrating the the concentration of hydrogen in these machines in the water uh, and I'll just kind of skim over it one more time each drop is calculating 0.1 parts per million or ppm of hydrogen in the water now that is if this beaker which, is a, which if you go purchase H2 Blue, if you go to the H2 Blue website, this beaker here is that comes with it. And it comes packaged just like this. And it comes, comes with a cap on it. Uh, and, and you take the cap off, pull the H2 Blue out, and this is a beaker. And the beaker has milliliters. See the ML? Down here is you got the five. That's five milliliters. And right here you got six. So the, the, the instructions on here actually read... Um, that it's a H2 blue is a, is a novel redox solution capable of determining H2 presence and concentration fill beaker with hydrogen water to six milliliters line add drops until the water remains blue each drop of hydrogen uh, H2 blue equals 0.1 part per million of hydrogen so example 10 drops would be one part per million hydrogen now I last time I showed you guys just uh, the awesome quality of this H cure from Zontos and today I am going to compare it with we won't name them but one of the best ionizers on the market okay and we we want to put this thing to rest um, because ionizer companies are having a very tough time uh, trying to con convince well at least the people who know um, they can't convince us that there's any therapeutic levels of hydrogen in the water. So we're going to just take a test. We're going to find out. All right, so we'll take the test on here first. Okay, we're going to go to this. We're going to we're going to we're going to go to this alkaline. It says it's got an ORP, which is the the magic number stuff, right? That's what they say. We're going to take it up a notch, and we're going to go to pH nine point two. This is the alkaline three. We're gonna just give it a second. That way it can run through the through the filtering a little bit and 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 let it do its thing. That way we can potentially get some hydrogen from them. Um, in the meantime, we'll go ahead and uh, um, well we'll just wait for this one. We'll see what this one's got here and and we'll go from there. Because who knows? Maybe maybe we're all mistaken here. But we're gonna put it to rest today. All right, we're gonna we're gonna fill this speaker up to a six milliliter line. And as you can see, I'm trying to get to the camera here. We are a little bit over the six mil line. So if there's any hydrogen in the water, uh, it's actually going to be this is this is better for the system here. Uh, if there's anything in the water, now we're gonna go we're gonna drop the drops in. And I'm going to show you where I'm at here. We're going to drop the drops in at one at a time. We're going to one, two, three. Not even. Not even. Three. Now let's see if it turns clear again. Um, if I add double the amount, that would be half the amount of, of hydrogen in the water. No, it's not even at one point. It's not even at 0.15. I fill this thing up. As you notice here, it is completely blue. Now, I that tells me that there is no hydrogen at all. It's being washed. In coming from this ionizer. Now, we're going to compare it to the Zontos hydrogen 
water generator. Some of these ionizer companies are actually changing their names to from ionizers to hydrogen technology because they well they see the wave they see what's coming and they don't want to miss it they'd rather be unethical with their customers and you know what that's just not how Zontos wants things and that's not how we want the as a customer base that's not how we want to be um, representing the public so we're gonna we're gonna check it out here we're gonna see how much this has in it now right now I'm at just a little bit over six where am I at here I'm a little bit over six we're just gonna go just dump out just a hair we want to get a very accurate reading here all right that's at six milliliters okay here we go one two three four already passed five six Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Now you see that blue? We saw that the other day. And watch. Watch how it clears up a bit. That means there's still hydrogen in that water. So I'm at twenty. That's two parts per million, okay? Now we're just gonna, we're gonna add just a little bit of this water to it, this hydrogen water from the h cure, And let's see what, what it happens. This is pretty cool. I want y'all to see this. Hey, what happened to the, to the blue? It's clear again. You know what that means? That means there's hydrogen reacting. It's a hydrogen reagent. Now if I, if I let this sit here, it would end up turning blue again but now watch watch what happens here if I add too much of the uh, uh, regular water or let's just try some of this this ionized water it's been washed don't drink the water coming out nice. level 3 alkali water okay. is coming out okay let's just see what happens here it's being washed well, it's already happening. Do you see how it's turning blue again? That's because of the concentration of, lack of concentration thereof, of hydrogen in the water that's turning it back blue from this high concentration of two parts per million. And we went a little bit above, it turned it blue, which means that that machine right now is, is producing 2.1 parts per million or two parts per million. Uh, which is fantastic. It only is only rated for 1.2 to 1.6 parts per million. And then we added a little bit, just a little bit, and it turned it all clear again, which is proof of the hydrogen in the water. And then, you know what? We just added the, the, ionized, or the ionized water just to see if it stayed clear. What happened? Turned blue. So anyway, I'm Jason, guys. I think the proof is right here. Hydrogen is created with a hydrogen generator. The therapeutic levels are amazing. Ionizer, sorry guys, you lose. Till next time.